do we have here? Ooh. Let's take these for a run. What's up guys? So today I will be doing a review for these shoes. I'm going to be doing this actual review at a worldwide charity event called the Worldwide Walk. And that's where we're going today. It's currently uh, 6.25 a.m. And we're gonna all going to meet at Footscray Park. And uh, there's going to be a heap of us today. So I thought I'd just bust these out and uh, do a little bit of a, a, a wear tester there. Alright, let's get going. We're here at the actual worldwide walk site and um yeah a lot of people gathering up already but it's an actual official event man it's like a, you need to get like wristbands and you have to be like counted at everything because what's really good about this event is that it actually gets counted in the guinness book of records as uh we're trying to i think we're trying to beat another record so that's gonna be fun this charity helps people in africa all the kind of really hungry people in Africa. Hopefully it provides uh, aid to them as well. And so far I gotta admit, these uh, Odyssey racks are pretty good. It's pretty comfy. Compared to the Ultra Boost, just by initial break-in, it's probably almost the same. As much as I like the colorway better, they look really plain. <laughs> they don't stand out, stand out as much as my other um, Epic Reacts. But these Odyssey racks are pretty good too, so I'd actually really mind. The Odyssey Reacts and the Epic Reacts, they break in really easy. Like, it, they, it's almost instantly that they break into, so that's why I really like it. And then do some running or something, man, it's cold as to actually, like, like get the real fu full feel of them and stuff. Yeah, thanks. Where are we at today, guys? Ah. We're so enthusiastic right now. That's a cool setup you got there, Brother Mark. Thanks. gonna do like a, a lap I think it's 1.6 kilometers doing it for charity too man for the wristbands helping those starving kids out in, not just starving kids but like the you know the people out in Africa so it's for a good cause so this is also happening like around the world so that's pretty awesome like all at the same time try to beat this Guinness Book of Records man let's do it let's do it What is up guys? So that was a little bit of a video regarding the actual worldwide walk that we did. It's a, it was a charity walk and uh, you know, it's to fight poverty and mainly in uh, Africa. Uh, I'll leave a link down below so you can actually see the details on how like this actual charity helped those people fight poverty in actual Af Africa. But let's get to the main kind of, uh, let's get to the main review. So the main kind of uh, features that this kind of uh, shoe has is as you can see, 
from the uh, sole it has the react foam cushioning this if you haven't worn them in the previous past it is unbelievably comfortable um, I really highly praise this kind of shoe it's it's life-changing guys <laughs> the kind of a cushioning that it has compared to like let's say your formal thin hard uncomfortable work shoes that you have to wear like for yeah for work or whatever and then you kind of wear something like this it's it's such a blessing for your feet the way that i could probably explain the best is that any other shoe feels a lot more ordinary but when you actually put these on you feel like a superhero because <laughs> i've been watching avengers and that's uh, for some reason it went into my head so the main differences between this and the nike epic react is that it's got this kind of uh, fly mesh material, but it still has a ventilation uh, kind of areas here at the toe box, which kind of provides air to go in from the shoe this way. And it kind of cools down your foot, especially if you, if you have sweaty feet. So this is a very well performing shoe in terms of like going to the gym, doing cardio, all those kind of activities. Also, it's very snug, I would like to say. This neoprene tongue is uh, kind of uh, detached from the actual uh, upper this mesh upper it's got a really tight lockdown which is really if you if you really like the snug feel this is the perfect shoe for you also you know it's got these other kind of little features like this one it's this little plastic heel plate that they have uh, kind of improved on from the Nike Epic React this helps in terms of like pronating your foot because some people when they run sometimes their foot kind of turns this way this plate kind of prevents that from happening well it's not like it won't prevent it from happening but you know it'll happen less if you know what i'm talking about this shoe has also got thicker materials which is what i like it's got a really thick collar here it's got this really thick um tpu heel counter as well this honestly feels like it gives more stability but i find that it provides a lot more kind of stability in terms of like running and uh walking i really like the kind of overall fit of this shoe when i first wore these I, it felt like it was really snug like almost too snug but once i broke them in it felt way better i think it's because when i actually did give this a test run i was wearing really thick socks and that kind of affected the feel of it as well but once i got going with i did a couple of like runs or whatever this kind of broke in really nicely and yeah it's it's a beautiful shoe so i really highly suggest that guys if you want something like when you're traveling that can provide really good support and help you last those really long distances especially if you're traveling by foot and going to different places i really highly suggest you get a shoe like this or the nike epic react a shoe like this will help you get further in terms of traveling i like the color kind of the colorways as well i feel like this one is a little bit more durable compared to the nike epic react main things are because it's got the rubber kind of uh paneling here on the outsole uh, so it provides a little bit more dur durability and also a little bit more like kind of grip if you if I may say it's got thicker material so I really believe that this one this kind of shoe will last a really long time especially if you only bring one shoe when you go traveling I really highly suggest you get something like this because yeah it's very durable it's very comfortable and uh, also the price point guys it is only $180 technically that's still you know that, that can be a uh, like a little bit high for some people but you can also get a 10 percent discount if you go to if you go to a store like uh Foot Locker. so you know that helps out as, as well but in terms of price compared to the actual value you actually get from the shoe i would really probably say that you get a lot more value from something like this compared to like let's say an air max shoe because this nike react foam cushioning this is what kind of like sells it it's so comfortable guys i'm telling you it's it's unbelievably comfortable it's a blessing for your feet so i'm in love with the react cushioning uh that nike has uh, actually created and um yeah that's that's probably the most that i could actually say about this shoe yeah, if you guys have any questions please let me know in the comments down below or just message me but yeah it's it's a fantastic shoe guys and i would like to really hear your thoughts on this actual shoe if you've actually got this one what what do you think about this shoe compared to the nike epic react i would like to kind of hear feedback about that as well yeah i will also be doing 
a video about the Nike Epic React versus the Odyssey React 2. Stay tuned for that guys. And that's all I could really say about this beautiful shoe. And uh, you know, if you've made it this far, I hope you guys can please subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And if you really like this video and you found some really good value from it, please give me that big thumbs up. It's around that area, that area I think. <laughs> but I really wanna say thank you guys for once again watching this video. Uh, it means a lot to me and I hope I, I did actually give you a better insight on this shoe on whether you should buy it or not If you are on the kind of fence, I really kind of think that You know, you, you need to try something with this foam cushioning once in your life. So once again, thank you guys for watching this video I will have more videos coming in the future. So once again, thank you and I shall see you soon